Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, cyclic uh, quadrilateral uh, ABCD fully inscribed uh, in a circle as you can see in this uh, diagram such that uh, this angle uh, A is being represented by 5Y minus uh, 3. Angle uh, B is uh, 5Y. Angle uh, C is uh, 9X uh, plus 2. And finally, the angle D is being represented by 8x plus 3. And now our task is to calculate the value of x plus y. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the skill. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step since we are interested in calculating uh, the value of x plus y. So therefore, we must uh, find the value of x uh, and the value of y first. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, quadrilateral uh, A, B, C, D. And now let's recall uh, this uh, formula for interior angle sum of this uh, quadrilateral. Interior angle sum is always equal to n minus 2 times 180 degrees, where n represents the number of uh, polygon sides. And in our case, uh, our uh, polygon sides uh, are uh, 4. So therefore, n is going to be equal to 4. So therefore, interior angle sum of this quadrilateral is going to be, I'm going to plug it in uh, this n value as 4 uh, minus uh, 2 times 180 degrees. So if we simplify that is going to give us 2 times 180 degrees. That means that is going to give us 360 degrees. So therefore interior angle sum of this quadrilateral ABCD turns out to be 360 degrees. In other words the sum of all these four angles must be equal to 360 degrees. So therefore, I'm going to add up all those four angles. So I'm going to write down 5y minus 3 plus 5y plus 9x plus 2 and plus finally 8x plus 3 is going to be equal to 360. And now we can see this negative 3 and positive 3, they are gone. We are now going to combine the like terms. That is going to give us 17x uh, uh, plus uh, 10 times uh, y plus uh, 2 equals to 360. And now we are going to subtract uh, 2 from both sides. They are uh, gone. So therefore, uh, 17 times uh, x uh, plus uh, 10 times y turns out to be equal to 358 and I'm going to label this one as our equation uh, number one and now let's recall the definition of a cyclic uh, quadrilateral a quadrilateral which has all of its uh, four vertices uh, lie on a circle as you can see in our diagram all uh, these vertices a b c d are lying uh, on the very same circle and such kind of uh, quadrilateral is also called uh, inscribed uh, quadrilateral and now let's recall uh, another crucial fact the opposite angle in a cyclic quadrilateral uh, add up to 180 degrees in other words they are uh, supplementary angles so therefore uh, the angles uh, this angle a and this angle c that adds up to 180 degrees so let me write down 5y minus 3 plus 9x plus 2 equals to 180. And now let's combine the like terms. So we can write 9x plus 5y minus 1 is going to be equal to 180. And now we are going to add 1 on both sides. This is gone. So therefore, we got 9x plus 5 times y equals to 181. And I'm going to label this one as our equation number 2. 
and now we are going to focus on these two opposite angles this angle B and this angle D if we add them they add up to 180 degrees as well so therefore we can write uh, 5y plus uh, 8x plus 3 is going to be equal to 180 and now we are going to subtract 3 from both sides they are uh, gone so therefore on the left hand side we got uh, 8x uh, plus uh, 5y turns out to be equal to 177 I'm going to label this one as our equation number 3 and now we are ended up with these uh, three equations and we are going to solve them for uh, x and y and now let's focus on this uh, equation 2 and here I have copied down this uh, equation 2 over here and now we are going to multiply both uh, sides of this equation by negative 2 so once we multiply by negative 2 this equation is going to become uh, negative 18x minus uh, 10 times y equal to negative 362 and now let's focus on this uh, equation 1 and here I have copied down uh, equation 1 over here and now we are going to add uh, these two equations and if we add them this negative 10y and positive 10y they are gone on the left hand side if we combine uh, these two terms uh, negative 18x plus 17x is going to give us uh, negative x uh, is going to be equal to negative 4 on the right hand side if we multiply both sides by negative sign so therefore our x value turns out to be positive 4 and that's our x value so thus our x value turns out to be 4 and now we are going to find the value of uh, y as well and now let's focus on this uh, equation 3 and here I have copied down this uh, equation 3 over here 8x plus uh, 5y equal to 177 and we know we figured out our x value is 4 so therefore I'm going to substitute uh, this uh, x value for over here so therefore this equation is going to become a times 4 plus 5 times y equal to 177 let's simplify that is going to give us 32 plus 5y equal to 177 and now I am going to subtract 32 from both sides they are gone so therefore 5y turns out to be equal to 145 and I am going to divide both sides by 5 to isolate y so therefore our y value turns out to be 29 so thus our x value turns out to be 4 and y value is 29 and here's our final step now we are going to calculate the value of uh, x uh, plus y so we know our x value is 4 and y value is 29 so I'm going to substitute that one 4 plus uh, 29 is going to give us uh, 33 so thus our x plus y value turns out to be 33 and that's our final answer Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.